limiting refraction and critical angle if this is the common boundary and this is the denser medium the rarer medium imagine a ray incident in the delta medium and refracted to the rarer medium It will bend away from the normal if the angle of incident is increased angle of refraction also will be increased according if you keep on gradually increasing the angle of incident finally there will be a situation the angle of refraction becomes 90 degrees in other words the angle of incident gradually increases so that finally the refracted ray is passing along the common boundary that is called limiting refraction and the relevant angle of incident for limiting refraction is called the critical angle for that common boundary denoted by capital in limiting refraction angle of refraction is 90 degrees therefore if we consider a ray propagate opposite direction 90 degree angle becomes angle of incident and c becomes angle of refraction so we can write n the refractive index of the denser material relative to rarer material is sin i over sin r that is sin 90 over sin c Turn one over sine c because sine ninety is one. So n is given by one over sine c. If the angle of incident is further increased, so that is greater than critical angle. then angle of refraction has to become greater than 90 that is not possible no more refraction is possible when angle of incident is greater than critical angle what happens is reflection 100% of light energy incident will be reflected back to the same denser medium according in, in accordance with the loss of reflection that incident is called total in